Hello guys, it is Rebel Ninja here and welcome back to Sleep This Night 2. We're gonna continue this game, finished it. Alright? Because I haven't played this for a while and memory's fading on the game. So I better finish it as fast as, as soon as possible before I just forget about everything and be like, what the fuck happened here? What the fuck happened to this game, you know? Just be lost and shit. Okay, anyway, we're gonna finish, get all the endings, finish this. Uh, Suzuka's route, so we followed her, and and um, now we have options to choose to go to places we are going to go to the living room. And what's going to happen in the living room? Well, no one's here. Good thing, I guess. Say your music box again. Oh, music box. I skipped the dialogue. It play by itself, and it's like, what the fuck? And she turned it off, and it's playing again by itself. So, yes, but how can that be? It sounds like it's near, but I'm sure I left it in my room. Dot. Let's look for it. She must have it in a pocket somewhere. I mean, come on, dude. Let's look for it. It has to be in this room. It's not here. Wait a moment. I'll look in the hallway. Are you sure? So we're gonna get a stay here. Leads to the ending, of course. That's why. That's the, that's the whole main. This is the whole point of this game. You're safe here. I'll be right back. The music stops. And Suzuka. <laughs> her body's torn apart, like half of her body. It's oh, oh, uh, blood trail leads somewhere else. I don't know where, but damn, girl, <laughs> what happened? I was gone for just a second. Someone tore her apart, or rather, something. The room smells burned. I have to escape. Suddenly, a spark from the fireplace lands on the carpet. In less than a heartbeat, the whole room is on fire. This girl is on fire! Sorry. I have no chance to escape. Somehow I think this wasn't a coincidence, but now my boy's burned to ashes. This girl is on fire! Burning burn. Suzuka and I are dead. Natsumi and Midori's status is unknown, and let's move on to the next ending. Alrighty, let's go to the kitchen. Yeah, let's make us some sandwiches while everything around us is going crazy. Midori's not here. She's probably with Natsumi. Oh yeah, that's right, because Natsumi um, suggests, well, she wants us to go and search around the library and Midori's like, Okay, I'll go to the kitchen then and find out what happens now. Because of the sound from the kitchen, there was like plate, the plate smashed in the ground or some shit. And you could hear it from the living room, so she's probably with Natsumi if you say so. Looks like this room is clean. Clean in the literal sense of the teapot. You're joking, that's that's really not the moment to make jokes. Actually, all that old tea is pretty disgusting, Dot. You're an idiot. I'm just saying, it wouldn't hurt to do the dishes now and then. Ooh sorry. Forget it. Just tell me what we should do now. So, second ending. Escape through the garden door. Let's get away from here. We should escape through the garden door. And leave the others behind. Good idea. I have no signal myself. But maybe I can call the police outside. That would teach them. Gosh, driven out of my own house, I'll teach them a lesson. Finally, I can use my cell. So wait, you live in the middle of nowhere, basically. Hello, my name Hello, my name is Suzuka Masaki. Is this the police? <laughs> Shizuka called the police and the arrest arrested Natsumi and Midori for trespassing. Why? You invited us in the first place. And you got them arrested. Good job, Suzuka. Good fucking job. I'm not sure if it was the right thing to do. It wasn't the right thing to do. It's unnecessary. It's not really sensible, I would say. But I'm glad I'm finally out of this horror house. Who knows what really happened? Yeah, I wonder. Bad ending whistleblower. You are alive, Natsumi and Midori statuses uh, were they're arrested. Suzuka is also alive. Alright, here's the thing. We're gonna make Suzuka turn on the light. The lights are probably the fuse box is probably in the basement that I or the attic, wherever it is. Um we're gonna make her turn on the light. Since it's a house, she knows the lay of the house, and we don't know shit about it. Let's do it. It's your house, you can turn on the lights, right? I have to go to the basement and check the fuses. Maybe a fuse is blue. 
So, could you do this? Gosh, do I have to? Yes, it's your house. It's your fucking house. Okay, okay, I'll go. Hmm, I wonder how long this would take. Oh my god. Dots. Suzuka! It looks like her eyes were glass and someone crushed them. She... She killed me. Who? Midori? Kitsumi? Kitsumi. Kitsumi. Yeah. Suddenly she jumped at me. Someone or something seemed to control her possession. I mean, she got possessed. It's clearly that she's possessed. It's Anyway, <laughs> how is this possible? Did Kazumi control her or maybe someone else? Could be Kazumi, you never know. Now I never know. Better than Kazumi's revenge. So, um, we're both dead. Did Tsumi and Midori say this is unknown? Okay, this ending is slightly different. We gotta go to the library. Of course, our endings are different zero. Jeez, they can't be the same or else be really boring and... Yeah, it gets pretty tedious. If you ask me, but uh, it's fine, let's go to the library. Where is that Sumi? I thought she'd be here. Mm, no surprise, I guess. What do you mean? What do you mean, no surprise? It's obvious that they want to scare us. I'm not so sure about that. Well, I guess it's, there's no one in this house but us. Are you sure about that? They could be somewhere in this house. We don't know. What should we do now? Oh, we're gonna wait. When we're here, the lights come back on. You serious? Sure, why not? It won't take so long, right? Okay, this uh, this way. And Sumi and Midori can't scare us anymore. We waited and waited, but nothing happened. It was like we were frozen in time. Years passed without either of us noticing. I can't explain why we didn't die of hunger or thirst. But after many years, our bodies molded dust. Ooh, wow. Bending bone dust. We're both- we're all dead. Why is- wait, why are we all dead? We don't know what happened to Midori and Natsumi though. That's, that's the thing, we don't know what happened to them. I don't know! Two more to go, two endings to go, if I am not mistaken. We go to the kitchen, but it's a different scenario. We- we're not gonna stay in the room for long. So that's not like- oh. Fucking yeah. And we're gonna skip the dialogue because we have passed through them. There's no point reading them again. Rereading them. Uh, skip. And there's an option to go to another room. We'll go to the library this time. We'll leave to the living room. Like, we'll go to the living room last. Same dialogue. We're gonna skip. Because why not? And let's go to the library. I'm oh, not sorry. We're in the library. Let's go to the living room. No one's here, we have done this bit. Um, I can't remember what happened in this one. Duel? I can't remember now. Um, does she have to stay with me or, or stay here or come with me? Yeah, I can't, she has to come with me, right? Yeah. You should come with me, it's safer. Okay. Hmm, looks like the music stopped. Weird, we checked every place, what now? Seems like Midori and Atsumi ran away. You should go now and I go to bed. Why would you go to bed in this kind of circumstances right now? I wouldn't do it. I'm like, hey, can we go back to your place or something? That's that's much more sensible right here, that's Suzuka. Oh, and also, I forgot to tell you this. At the start of the game, I replayed it and stuff. I didn't earn her trust, I didn't earn her trust by insisting an answer about her boy like boy about boyfriends. So I, I made a just tell me, so I ins insist on the answer. She got really pissed off. Of course she did. I would get it pissed off if I was her too. So yeah, shit's gonna go down by the look of it. Cause I don't think it's the, this is the true ending of this path. And I really thought I could make new friends here. Something's not right, she can't go to sleep. I'm pretty sure she'll die if she does. She will! I have to stop her. Suzuka, please trust me, we have to get out of here. Thoughts. Ooh, she's burst. You're talking nonsense. I knew I wouldn't make any friends tonight. You're just like the other girls. Suzuka, please. Good night, bitch. And I just have to wait for that beautiful sound. It feeds me. It feeds my satisfaction. 
So, she's dead, better sell of it. Suzuka, why didn't you listen? I left the house and called the police. They found Suzuka dead in the bed, her body was torn apart. Midori and Itsumi were missing, of course, they suspected me. They found my fingerprints everywhere in the house and on Suzuka's body. I was arrested and received a life sentence. Wow! Wow! We get arrested and receive a life sentence. That's lovely. Great ending to the story. Ha, admit. So, Natsumi and Midori are missing, Suzuka is dead, and I'm arrested. That's fucking great. Here we are again in the living room. We have been. We've gone to the library and the, um, the kitchen, so. Same concept, but with the trust, with Suzuka's trust, we earn a trust by dropping, by just dropping the conversation about the boyfriend stuff. So, but boys, so we earn a trust by that. So she's fine. We're fine. We're gonna get her to come with us to escape from the house. Same dialogue. I guess uh, same dialogue to start. So we check her place. Yep, same. And about going to bed and we make friends. Something's not right. She can't sleep. I'm pretty sure she'll die if she does. I have to stop her. Suzuka, please. Trust me. We have to get out to get up here. Well, I guess we agree that we trust each other. Thank you. Yes, we did. Then let's get out. We will spend the night at your place. Thank the fuck God. Someone's talking sense right now. I have to thank you. Dude. Okay, anyway. Leave the place. Um, what is this? I have the music box with me. I guess that's a sign. You should have it. Wait, what? No! What's Suzuka? It was a present from your aunt. I know, but I want you to have it. It will protect you from harm. I'm glad I could make at least one friend tonight. Hallelujah! Okay. Thank you. I never had. I, never, I have never had a real friend. No, don't cry. Why are you crying? Uh, I had something in my eyes. No, that, uh, they were called tears. Those things in your eyes, they were tears. You cried. I saw that. Sure. Let's go. I'm looking forward to see your house. It's not as big as yours, but at least we'll be safe there. We left Suzuka's house behind us, but I couldn't help but feel a bit uneasy. We had no idea what where the other girls were. I hope they're well. Suzuka's ending. They're alive. Hatsumi and Midori's statuses are unknown. Suzuka's also alive. That's so awesome! We beat this fight. No, we haven't beat the game yet. Um, <laughs> we finished the part. We finished all the endings to um Suzuka's path. So I'm pumped for the true endings. So this is the end of the video. We'll continue this series by completing um, what was it? The true endings, all of true endings. So we'll do that in the next episode. I really thank you guys. So I'll see you next time, and I uh, love you guys. Bye.